Now, I'm sure you can feel it in the air. You can feel it through your screens that it is a very special Monday, a very special start to the month of October. We're joined this morning in studio by one of South Africa's most celebrated music icons, Mum Tandega. PJ Powers is in the house! <laughs> Celebrate! Lulu Late, of course, an award-winning, multi-platinum selling music legend with hits such as, such as Jabulani, World in Union, the iconic one that everyone around the world listens to and says, yeah, now we know it because of that version. And uh, here's one of her latest renditions of her hit single. Ladies and gentlemen, Africa Boraka Bopara, PJ Powers is in the house. It, it's so beautiful for me to watch that and, and to think of the days when I first heard World in Union. Because I was almost as Were young you as... Were you born? I was. I was, <laughs> fortunately. Uh, uh, fortunate I was to have heard it. And now to see it being continued and our young ones now celebrating it and enjoying it. How, how special was it to, to do that with the... Oh, very special. You know, we did that in COVID, in the middle of COVID. Wow. And um, if you think about the fact that each one of those children were on their own filming their segments. Yes. Um, you know, I was on my own in the studio. The bass player, Skull Yobea, was on his own. Everybody, all the musicians, Tigger Roy in it, at the, at the every person was shot separately. I mean, for me, um, it's, it's, a, it's an editing Oscar. It's a masterpiece. It really is. But uh, we were talking earlier on about the fact that you are still enjoying and loving what you do so much. Do you I think do. that that is part of the secret to being such a successful multi-generational artist? Because that's how I see you. I think that, yes, I definitely think so. I mean, I've never heard it put like that, but yeah, now that you say it, um, I do love what I do, and I feel very lucky and very blessed. And my sister-in-law often says to me that I was born under a lucky star. Yes. And I think that I was, because I've been given this incredible career, and I've been given it by people that I care about, which I think is, which I think is really makes it even more amazing, mm. is it's not just a, a blanket success that, that, you know, I really, really know and love the people that have supported that have supported me over the years. As I was saying earlier, I just did the, 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 um, the, 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 re, uh, the relaunch of the Jabalani Amphitheatre in Soweto, which is, of course, where my career was born in mm -hmm, 1983. Mm -hmm. And I was given the name of Tandega. Yes. And um, we did it on Sunday, and it was just amazing. That place was full and pumping, and people were shouting, she's ours, she's ours. And I just thought, sure, yeah, yeah, how yes. lucky I am to have had the life that I have, thanks to these people. And we are lucky to have you. Oh, and I think you. that's why you'd hear people screaming and shouting, she's ours. And I wonder to, you know, up and coming artists who seek to have an impact um, on society the way that you have, because I think for me, it's more than the music. Um, what would you say is, is there a recipe? Is there a secret? If you were to give them some advice, I mean, we're spreading hope throughout the month and, and perhaps maybe that's a way that you could contribute to that message of hope for those young uh, artists saying, or looking at this right now and saying, I would love to have that kind of impact on the country like a PJ Powers. Um, well, first of all, I think it's fantastic that you are celebrating hope. It's, a, it's, it's, a, it's a brilliant, well done shot for who came up with this, because we, this is what we need most. Shout out to Anko Ingram OTC sponsors of okay. Brave. There they are, yeah, the team's well, all around. Shot to them, because <laughs> it's a brilliant concept. Um, my advice to young people that want to, first of all, if you have a platform, I believe I'm quite, quite severe about this. It's your, it's your duty, especially if you're living in South Africa, mm -hmm. I believe. Um, to use that platform, not all, not all, but a part of that platform for making the world a better place. Mm -hmm. um, and I think that perhaps um, a lot of young artists have, have lost sight of that. Um, and we need to bring that back. We need to say, it's, it's just not my career. I take my career very seriously. I don't take myself too seriously. Right. Um, and I think that 
we need to have more flow of give and take. It's actually old fashioned and 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 back to basics. That wisdom. And the, if you want to make an impact in the world, you got to start with yourself. Yeah. You were telling me something very exciting that I have to ask you about before before we say a temporary goodbye. But you've just signed a book deal. Yes, in I have. The United yeah. Kingdom. Tell yes. me a bit more about that. Well. Um, I did, uh, I released the book with, with which Marianne Tam and myself did in 2013. Mm -hmm. um, but of course, I mean, yeah, and it ends in 2013 and it ended when I sobered up. Um, so there's been all of this, what's it, 2013, 2020, it's almost 10 years, mm -hmm. um, which we're going to now fill out, plump up, um, put maps, timelines. Yes. Um, and all of that, that, to make it more accessible for a global market. Mm -hmm. And um, it will be launched in the UK next year. So I'm very, very wow. excited about that. Absolutely fantastic. And thank you so much for uh, taking the time and the energy to join us once again. It's always such a pleasure to have you here. We are privileged to call you part thank of this. Thank you, Katlejo. And yeah, I, lo I love being here. Absolutely. Oh, well, stay with us because we do have performances from the amazing Mom Tandega, PJ Powers, coming your way on your Feel Good Breakfast Show.